I just nursed the boy and now I'm gonna drink some cold water um yeah it seems to kind of wake me up and get me started on my day and my toddlers are awake so we're gonna have to get on to some breakfast there's hungry people in this house <laughs> he also wants breakfast Restless. Gonna give them some bananas while I make more stuff. Um, kind of hard when you're pregnant, but it seems like mama's always the last to eat. So hopefully we can get through this so I can get some food before my sugar drops too low. I nursed and I need food, but they need food too. So let's get them some snacks. More happy toddler and let's go see how the little guy is. Well, fella's got his bananas. Now maybe I can make some breakfast. I think he's a lot happier. So ladies, I am still in my pajamas. Well, it's a t-shirt, but it's what I slept in last night. Meltdown number one. Hang on. So now I have a little helper. Are you okay, sir? Are you okay? One is in the room playing good. One's going to be my helper right here. One's in his high chair. And let me just tell you, being a parent is not for the faint of heart. And we are not perfect at it. We love our babies, but we just are trying like everyone else. So today... I'm gonna try to make breakfast without any more meltdowns. So pray that I get through making these scrambled eggs. By the time you've watched this, it's already happened, but I'm sure I need prayers for the next time. So let's see if we can get through this. <laughs> Mama taught me to make scrambled eggs. I mean, normally you put it in a bowl and you scramble it, but this works and I need all the time saving tricks I can find. So I'm just gonna scramble it right into the pan. You ready? Let's go. Go give your brother a toy! Eggs are on, but baby's crying, so we're gonna go get him some Cheerios and see if it helps. Get your Cheerios! And yeah, the other one crying. She's crying because I had to pull her away from the stove. Imagine that. Toddlers. It's okay, I just didn't want you to be burnt! We gotta get back to the eggs. And we'll see how many more uh, meltdowns we have to uh, rescue before the eggs are done. Hopefully not too many more. It's hot or I'd let you stir more, okay? A little toast and let them butter it when it comes out because they need another job. Oh, is my toaster not plugged in? Let's get the toaster plugged in. We got the toast going and then they can butter it. Yeah. But this is the kind of bread I eat. Um, in my last pregnancy, I almost had gestational diabetes, so I've been trying to switch. So, like this, um, it's like a carb smart bread and it's whole grain, so it's not too bad. It's pretty good. I don't know how much of this I should even have, but it's what I've been trying to switch to. See if you left the eggs for too long. Hopefully, not. Looks like they're coming along. Okay. So, the eggs are pretty much done, and I'm going to let my other daughter um, butter some toast because she wants a job. And as you can see, it is definitely um, like wrangling a circus, trying to get breakfast going in the morning. Tell me, if you're a mama, how do you do it? Like, what are your tips, and is it like a lot better at your house, or am I just, <laughs> am I just not good at um, getting it all done? But everybody seems happy at the moment, and so the eggs are done. We're gonna butter toast, and I'll sit and chat with you in a minute. Lovely little helpers are buttering some toast, giving them something to do, and I'm gonna go make my toast. And are yeah, how's it going? It how's it going, buttering the toast? Good. Do you like doing that? Mm -hmm. yeah. This is what we have going on over here. He's probably ready for his eggs. We'll get that to him in just a minute. So I have one that doesn't really care for eggs. 
she hasn't since she was a baby. So I'm just going to make her a little bit of oatmeal. <sighs> and tell me, I don't really like to get in the habit of making different things for my kids. But I know if one really generally doesn't like something, I'll try to do something that I can substitute quick and easy. And this oatmeal packet is super easy and quick. Um, it'd probably be healthier if I made like my own oatmeal. But this is what I can work with right now. So that's what I do. Here's your oatmeal. Be careful, it's kind of hot. It's a little past 9.30 and I'm just now sitting down to eat my food. Um, yeah, it's, it's busy and it's a lot. <laughs> Food. Um, definitely it, it is a real uh, something you have to put effort into to get everybody fed and alive and happy. Um, being a mother, being a parent is definitely a full time job. Little oh, man is down there playing. We'll see if he lets me eat. But uh, yes, it's definitely a full time job. Um, you don't realize how much your parents went through until you have kids, and having them really close together um, really makes it a lot more i think having one baby though you still have to do everything you would for three so um but yeah and i'm kind of tired and weak now and i need to eat and my husband gets on to me for not taking care of myself sometimes but i mean babies have needs <laughs> so i'm gonna try to eat this and i will talk more with you in a little bit maybe when the baby goes for a nap And I was just going to say, this is just that bread I showed you, that like um, whole grain carb smart bread uh. with just a little margarine. Butter would be better. <laughs> he wants my food now. And strawberries and some eggs. And that's just what I'm having for breakfast. I'm going to drink some water. And I might have a smoothie later if I can get around to it. But that's what I eat for breakfast today. One more today. thing, any moms were late. So he's already eaten a lot of food. Now he wants mine. Mm. What am I going to do with this kid? So I'm going to go try to survive the rest of the day. Um, I hope you're surviving as well. And I'm going to say a prayer whoever's watching oh. that the Lord will be easy on yourself. Know that, you know, you're trying your best. There's other people that make it look easy sometimes on social media, but I think all of us are just trying our best. In and realize that like, it is a quiet minute, so maybe just a little bit here. And I wanted to come on and say thank you for watching. Um, I got a bunch of things I still have to get to yet today. Laundry, and dishes, and more baby things. Um, so if you think about it, pray for me that I survive this day and thrive through it. Um, I hope that you're surviving your day and thriving as well. Um, as I said in this video already, parenting is not easy. So whoever is in the thick of it, I commend you. And if you've gone through having little ones already, then please share your tips because I need more wisdom. I definitely could use all the wisdom. If you don't have kids yet, um, just soak it up and realize that it is definitely a journey. It's so worth it, but it takes everything in you and more. And um, you mamas out there, um, just hang in there. I gotta go rescue some situation. But hang in there and thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.